Hi loggers. Welcome back to another This, this week, week at, at Puget, Puget Sound. Sound. I'm Renee and we are here in the middle of Peyton Field. And I'm Sam, stepping in for Kiara from now on as your new This Week co-host. Let's look at this week's highlights. See literary inspired culinary creations at the Edible Books Festival at Collins Memorial Library. While there, stop by the opening reception for Transforming Knowledge, Altered Encyclopedias. The exhibit shows the work of local artists who were given a volume of the Encyclopedia Britannica from the Collins Library and asked to transform the pages into a unique work of art. Kick off Japan Week with a kimono lecture and dressing demonstration by Mariko Kayama, founder of Seattle's Kimono Art Store. This lecture is followed later in the week by a tea tasting, a Japanese film screening, shamisen and taiko drum performance and workshop, cookie decorating, and mochi making. English majors and minors and friends of the English department are invited to a game night. Hear about the natural environment in China, including the factors that are helping and harming it, at a symposium sponsored by the Asian Studies Program. Join current Washington State Poet Laureate Claudia Castro Luna and Washington State Book Awards finalist Glenna Cook, class of 94, for a poetry reading. On Tuesday, Arthur Barbara Brown Taylor will read from her latest book, Holy Envy, Finding God in the Faith of Others. The reading will be followed by a conversation with Pastor Dave Brown, founder of Blues Vespers and a member of the Pacific Northwest Interfaith Amigos. Logger up this week at the track and field meet or with the softball team as they take on George Fox. Make sure to grab your tickets for the Senior Theater Festival, which opens this week with Hedda Gabler, and for the Puget Sound Jazz Orchestra concert with guest artist Danilio Perez. Sign up with the Expeditionary for a Saturday climbing trip to Vantage. Or join SAIS, ASAPS, and the AFAM department for a trip to the Northwest African American Museum. Those are the highlights for this week, loggers. For more information on events and other things happening, go online. Bye. Bye.